Hi, I'm Ali and a warm welcome to Face Yoga Master. So in today's video, I thought I would share with you a gasha routine for the double chin and jawline using this amazing tool. Now, I do like to start so you have clean skin and I am using a little bit of facial oil here. If you have a neck cream or a face cream, that's fine too because whatever we apply to our face, it's going to really penetrate in even better. And also as a bonus for not dragging and pulling at the skin. Now I'm just first of all just warming it through my fingers the facial oil and then just gently apply above the chin jawline and underneath and then down by the side of the ears and the side of the neck. So first of all we're going to take our tool here and we're just gently going to use the top part and place my finger as an anchor and then from the chin I'm fairly flat because you have more surface area I'm just very gently gliding all the way along the chin and jawline and we're working the top part of the chin and also the jawline here and when you get to the ear if you just give it a little wiggle at the end as well and by doing this, because we're doing it slow and mindful and a very light press, we're also moving toxins and waste within the lymph. And then on the other side, finger as an anchor and just very lightly, just gently glide all the way to the ears. The end. So now we're going to take the part here, the bow part if you like, and I'm just starting from the collarbone and working my way in an upwards motion again towards the jawline and working my way all the way across and then to the chin area. Again nice and light. Swap hands again, just very gently gliding along. You may you want to swallow as well at this point as you can feel things moving along here. So now we're going to use the again the top part, and then we're working under the chin now and gently gliding all the way to the ears. We have plenty of lymph nodes in this area, so we really are moving everything along, particularly if you have any things, sort of any stagnant toxins and waste. And then again, top part, just gently gliding. We do this three times on either side, so just another, another two. And then again we're going to use this part here now and we're just gliding now from the chin and sort of part of the neck area slow and mindful towards the ears again i'm holding fingers as an anchor so we're not dragging and pulling at the skin nice and flat and then on the other side And last time. So now we're going to take this part here and we're just gently gliding down the front of the ear and then the back of the ear here again on the top part so just gently gliding the back of the ear and then with the bow part here we're just working down this big SEM muscle now, down towards the neck to the collarbone. And I like to do this three times. Again, just nice, light, delicate touch. And again, top part, 
just gently massaging the front of the ear and the back of the ear. And then with the bow part, gliding down the big SEM muscle down to the collarbone. And one last time. And then from the chin all the way down, where our collarbone is, we have a couple of indentations above. And if you can just give those a few gentle presses, this will release all the toxins and waste we've moved within this area and the chin area and also the jawline into the body ready for elimination. Now, if you're not already subscribed, please consider subscribing for more content and a thumbs up if you found the video useful. And I really look forward to seeing you in the next one. Okay, bye.